In this video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how I blow my video background with CapCut, right? So all you need to do is to make sure that you watch this video from beginning to the end. Join Growbita family today. Grow your social media platforms and make money online. You're welcome to Globeta and this channel will teach people how to build good their social media platform and also how to make money online. And if you're seeing me for the first time, I'm Azimilian and I would like you to subscribe to this channel and hit the notification button so that anytime I post a amazing video, that this one you're watching at the moment, you'll be among the first people to see the video. Right? So I'm gonna be going straight to the point, right? So I'll be taking you guys to the other side of the screen to show you guys exactly how I blow my video background. On CapCut. But before we get to the other side of the screen, I would like you to do something for me. I would like you to hit the like button and drop a comment. Even if you don't know what to say, you can actually say thank you, Marzi, for sharing this, and I'll be glad to respond to your comment. So see you guys in the other side of the screen. Okay, guys, let me quickly show you guys how I blow my video background with CapCut, right? So, firstly, before I come to blow my background, I normally used to do my color correction and everything then export my video right so after i've exported the video then i will now come and do the blur background right so let's go there all you need to do is to open a new project and import the video you In want to blow right once you've imported this video the next thing you need to do is to come to this uh, effect right here can you see effects right here tap on it once you tap on the effects you know so the next thing we we'll go to is the video effect you can see video effects right here so once you tap on this video effect right here and you see this line where you see trending opening opening and closing nightclub you just need to scroll it and look for lens you can see lens right here see lens right here then tap on lens once you tap on lens you'll be able to see blur you can see blur right here and you know, see blur here so you just tap on the blur in this right. video i'm you going to see the video already you can see the video is already blur right so but you know the blur is too much so what you need to do is to tap inside the blur right so that you'll be able to reduce it you understand so people put their their video on 30 20 and 50 you know, depending on how you want your video to be but due to because i don't really normally like my blood to be too much i just like my blood to be a little bit small you know so i normally put my video on 20 i normally put my own on 20 so once i put it on 20 i don't need to click on ok right and uh, another thing you need to consider is that once you you, you come right here you see that this blood doesn't reach the end can see don't reach the end so what you need to do is to come and tap the end of the the end of the blow then draw it draw it draw it till you get to the end of your video you can see the blow is now all over the place so what you need to do is to make sure that you, you, this line is in the beginning of the video then just go back and come to this overlay can you see overlay right here once you tap on this overlay you are going to be importing that same video the one that is that does not have blur understand which is this one i just need to import it back again then spread it to make sure that it fits in right that is fit in exactly the same way the other one is then the next thing you need to do is for you to now make sure that the video is selected and go and look for remove bg you can see remove bg right here can you see it very clear all you need to do is to tap on remove bg once you tap on remove bg you will see different option auto remover custom remover chroma key then you just need to click on this auto remover once you tap on auto remover you can see it's already uh, the background has been removed right and the only background left is the one that is blow right so you can see right here the root uh, restore so it is for you to restore it but so no need to restore but just click on okay right so then go back so the next thing i actually do is that I make sure that that particular video i, I imported by by overlay right is selected and i will go and look for adjust so that i will make my blow a very very strong by adding sharpen right so you can see adjust right here all i need to do is to enter adjust and i will ignore all this stuff right here and just come straight to sharpen so once i come to sharpen i i put my sharpen on 20 understand so it helps a lot when you are blowing always try put this sharpen it helps to strengthen the the video right so once I put the sharp on, the next thing I actually do is that I need to clean my face so that my face will look good. Understand? So I will just need to go and look for retouch. Alright. So here is retouch right here. You can see retouch right here. Tap on retouch and you can see face right here. Tap on face. Understand? Once you tap on face, then you'll be able to smoothen your face. Alright. So, so right here, I'm going to be clicking on smooth. As I click on smooth, then i will put my smooth on 45 i normally put my smooth on 45 
you understand so and I'll, I'll go to brighton and come to brighton and put my brighton on 20 you know then i'll come to white it and put my white it on 30 right then click ok guys as you can see the video has been blown and i've worked on my face everything is clear and i've strengthened the, the video with sharpen as you can see right now i've blurred this video's background and it's very simple so if you really want to blur a background on CapCut, just do exactly the same thing i did in this video after you have done it then all you need to do is for you to export and before you export make sure that your video is on 1080p or 4k 1080p is okay but anything below 1080p is not nice once you've done all this all you need to do is just to click on export and export your video so guys this is exactly how to blur your background on CapCut. so see you guys on the other side of the screen you welcome back guys hope you enjoyed this video if you found this video very interesting i would like you to hit the like button and drop a comment and if this is your first time in this channel i will urge you to subscribe to this channel because in this channel we share amazing content every day and you can't afford to miss them right so thank you all for watching and see you in my next video